So you made a noticeable difference when you came on against Ant Hill. Are you hoping to have that same kind of impact against Richmond? Um, yeah, hopefully. Um, you know, it will save all of our heart rates if we didn't have to leave it to the last minute. Um, no, as I said, it was a quite a difficult situation to come on in. Obviously, we were behind on the scoreboard. I just wanted to make, as you say, make some sort of a difference. Uh, just try and play a little bit more positively and hopefully we can start that way um, this weekend. So you started against Richmond when you beat them 4 to 12 in April. So what were the positives that you took away from that performance? Yeah, like we spoke about this week, I think last season that was probably our most professional performance. You know, we stuck to game plan. Um, you know, Richmond are a team where they're playing a lot with a lot of confidence at the minute. Um, so, you know, that, that can be quite dangerous. So for us, it's about, as I said, finishing the uh, starting the game like we finished against Amtil um, and try and keep the ball for, for a long period of time and try and starve them of possession. So what, aside from that, is the biggest thing that you need to take from this game in order to move on? Because it's the heart of the season coming up now, you've got a big run of games. How do you need to push on from there? Yeah, definitely. I mean, getting the win would be great. Um, but I think the performance is something that we're going to focus on this week. We haven't had an 80 minute performance yet this season. We've seen in, in patches what we can do, um, but we've lacked in other areas. So against Bedford, our attack was brilliant, but we didn't, we conceded too easy. Against Jersey, our defence was excellent. And against Amptil, you know, we weren't the complete performance at all. Um, so this weekend, it's all about, uh, all about us um, putting uh, that complete performance on. And, and as you've watched the session today, there was a lot of heat in the session, a lot of comp uh, competitiveness. Uh, and hopefully we can take that into the weekend. And what do you think is going to be the biggest threat that they pose? They're a very dangerous team. As I said, they play with a lot of confidence. When they're on the front foot, they look to offload. Um, they like to keep the ball for long phases. So for us, when we get the ball, it's about um, taking the points when they're on. And then in defence, it's about being patient and, and trying to break those, those barriers down. Because um, as we said, they've got a lot, of, uh, a lot of confidence in their team at the minute. They're, they're sitting uh, quite high up on the table. Um, they've got some dangerous individuals, so it's about taking that threat away from them and us uh, as a team, focusing us, as I said, as a team.